of Kitty appeared, and today for you, I am bringing you my vlog of Right Gone Winter 2018, and also this is gonna be um, a vlog of another thing as well that I'm doing tomorrow, and that is going to Edinburgh with my girlfriend to go see Jack Septicai. Now I'll give more details about what we're up to at Edinburgh later. But at the moment, yes, we're going to Rikon first. So yeah, as you can see, I am in cosplay. If you don't know who I'm supposed to be, I am um, Victor from Fury Ice. So yeah. So yeah, so this is me. So at the moment, I'm all ready to go. Just waiting for my girlfriend to come pick me up and then we'll be off to Rikon. So just having my wee breakfast there and also watching the old um, 90 sitcom Sabrina the Teenage Witch because why not? I was basically, I watched the new Netflix show The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina and it got me nostalgic so I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna rewatch Sabrina so yeah. Alright so that is me now in the car and we're off to Rikon! Woo! Woo! Um, yeah, so we're nearly there, and as you can see, the weather is awful, as you can see. It's horrible. Yes, but that's what you get when you live in Scotland. Um, but yeah, so, as I said to you before, I was cosplaying as Victor, and Jenny is cosplaying as Utebeck. Goodbye. <laughs> Doing that voice all day. Yeah. Dropping it. Yep. Um, I can be Utebeck all day. I was gonna try a Russian accent, but then I realized I'm awful at accents. <laughs> so no, I don't want to offend anyone. <laughs> There's a drop insert phrases that he says. Yeah. I'm just, if I'm sick, I'm gonna be, my voice is gonna be dropped down anyway, so yeah. I'm just gonna drop it down even more and find all the Yuri cosmos and go, Yuri, goodbye! <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, so, should be fun. Um, yeah. Obviously, it's not. Like, Rikon is not like as big as MCM, so not gonna be a lot of stuff, but still a lot of things to see at least. Yeah. A lot of artists and vendors and all that good shiitake. And money to burn. <laughs> <laughs> I have all the cash. Thank you, brother. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, anyways, right, we. Alright, next time you'll see us, we will be at the con. Bye. Hi, okay, so we're in Rikon. And Je Jenny spotted My Hero Academia blind box. So, yeah, anyone. So, who are you hoping for? Uh, Tutorogi. Yes. And it's not Tutorogi, it's fine because I can just move it and it's part of also and I'm fine with either of Yes. Okay. I cut my nails. <laughs> <laughs> where's, where's, where's Phoenix? Oh, come on. Did you get Parker? Did you? Oh, you I got took a Yay! I did the I'm here, Okay, yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm very good. I'm, I'm very I'm good. I got my hands up. I am. I am. You were going on my bike. Yeah. But yeah. So that was a good one. That was. But yeah, we will see you again soon. Okay, so yeah, so haven't vlogged much. Obviously, did the intro. Um, Get in the car, and then obviously Jenny's family reaction there. Yes. Yeah, we've just had food. Yes. It is good. We got hungry, and also it's really hot there because. Yeah. But I'm extra hot because I'm in a freaking wig. Yes. I am not. Yeah. So so far, I have spent quite a bit. Of money. And obviously, I'm not going to show you because I'll do a haul at some point. Then you can see it all. But. Yeah, so far, I think it's been a good success for buying stuff. I, we've been bumping into people that we saw at MCM. Yep, and I finally uh, saw uh, someone I met at the Comic Con. Tried to meet up at MCM, but just too late. But she's an artist. Which I did get artist stuff from, so I will, when it's the hall, I'll tell you what that is. But yeah, so far, good day. Yes. Um, yeah, so 
shots and stuff of Ray Gun. Yes. There's not a lot of events, obviously they have this Ray on as much as an MCM. And then there is a panel we were looking at. Yeah. Is it? Is it? In five minutes? Uh, yeah, we might want to head back then. So, see you guys later. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so I know I've not been vlogging much, but just, you know, not a lot of stuff usually happens here. It's normally just buying things. I bought a lot, so I might just do a ride on haul and just whatever I buy in it. Yeah. Yeah. So, so I saw these earlier that obviously you were seeing earlier. Uh, Jenny gave one and she got her favorite. Yeah. Um, so, yes, I've obviously I've told you guys before, but personally got into it. So, yeah. I think for me, I don't mind who I get. Like, I would like to get um, a Deku because Deku is the best boy. Because he's adorable. The cinnamon roll. But, yeah. So, I think the only one I wouldn't want to get is that guy. Who is obviously... I can never pronounce his name. Fingers over it. Yeah. That's yeah, that's one of them. Yeah, just... That one. Yes, because he creeps me out. So, and if you watch My Hero Academia, you know what? Yes. Um, but yes, so, let's see who I've got. Because I'm not going to bother doing any unboxing, because I didn't buy a lot of blind boxes, so I'm not going to play. Dun 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 dun! Did you get Deku? <laughs> I'm so happy I got Deku! We both got our favourites. Yes. Oh, yeah. Clearly, I'm so the luck. The Lock and Black Box is as much better with us at Rikon than it is at, at MCM. At MCM. Oh, oh my god. I get this boy. Yes. Adorable little toy. That I've actually seen people say that it's like human version of a hobby. He really is. But yes, Alright, see you guys soon. And that is Rikon done. Yay. Yay. We're all tired. <laughs> So yeah, that's right on done. I have bought quite a few things. Um, obviously you saw my reaction to getting Deku, so I was happy with that. that. Like we both got our favourite boys. Yes. So we're good. Uh, yeah. Um, but yeah, so um, I, like, I know I haven't really vlogged much today, but as I stated before, I am going to Edinburgh tomorrow, but I can't remember if I told you guys why we're going to Edinburgh. But I'll tell you now at least. We are going to go see the one, the only, Jacksepticeye. Ooh. But yeah, that'll be fun. So tomorrow just mainly just be us going around Edinburgh, probably just filming a few things and having a bit of a laugh because obviously the show doesn't start till like eight. Eight. So, yeah, so we'll just go about and obviously I'm not going to show you the Jacksepticeye tour because I'm not, I'm not that person. You also don't want to be famed. No, no, not that either. I'll probably like maybe show you shots of like the theatre, but that's about it. But... If it's a nice screen before it starts. Yeah, then maybe... before it starts. Yeah, maybe that or, because or like there's like posters outside of it or something. Yeah. That's probably as much as I'm going to show you, and then probably tell you how the show was. But, the rest will be just us hanging about in Edinburgh until that time. Yes. So yeah, because I was thinking, I didn't know if I was going to turn this video into two separate videos, but I think from as much as I filmed today, I think it's definitely okay to turn this into one big video. Yes, plus you need to show me geeky stuff in Edinburgh because I have no idea. Yes, there is an anime shop called Anime Republic. I'm pretty sure there's a good friend of the in Edinburgh, but I need to check that again. Um, obviously, there's the Harry Potter shops, and also, I think you said, we, like, I might try and see if I can show Jenny the the cafe that um, J.K. Rowling wrote, The Chamber of Secrets. But apparently, because I went on a Edinburgh tour thing, and they basically, the cafe claims that J.K. Rowling wrote the first book at that cafe. Apparently, that's a big fat lie. Apparently, no, it's just the second book she wrote in there. Oh. Okay. Yeah. According to the tour, anyways. Right. Yeah. So, yeah. But, I mean, still, J.K. Rowling was there, so... Yeah, she was... She went there to write the Chamber of Secrets. And I think, like... I think they also said, like, she... Oh, obviously, she used to go to a lot of cafes to write, but then when she got, obviously, super popular, people were obviously trying to see Cavus <coughs> peak. So, she ended up going to, uh... 
like hotels and stuff to write, which is yeah, fair enough. But apparently, there's another fact that uh, there's a hotel like where she would wrote the last book, and when she finished her like the last chapter, she took a marker pen and wrote at the back, J.K. Rowling was here, like saw something Harry Potter, like the year, and oh. now the hotel overcharged for that room. Of course they did. Yes. But yes. Um, anyways, guys, yes, I will see you guys tomorrow. So, bye! Hey, so yes, we are now in Edinburgh. Yay! So it's the next day. Um, yes, you can probably notice that the quality is kind of wet. Um, I was a bit of an agent and uh, forgot to bring my camera. <laughs> I don't know, this camera looks really good. You might be uh, okay quality wise. No, trust me, I'll notice the difference. Okay. But I don't know, it might be just me. Because I'm a me I used to do media, so I noticed these things. Yeah. Uh, but probably you guys probably wouldn't be fussed. Unless you did video like me. Um, but yeah, we got into... Uh, just just literally got here a few minutes ago. 10, 15 minutes ago, something um, like that. Maybe longer. Yeah, but we... Um, I remember last time I came to Edinburgh to do a, a Harry Potter thing. There's an anime shop um, called Anime Republic. Had a wee look in there. It's, just, it's a pretty good, decent shop with a lot of things. Like, my god, I've got a lot of things in there. Yes. Um, just trying to see if I can get a. See how much. If they had a Deku pop. I did find one in um, Forbidden Planet in Glasgow, but I had to be smart with my money. I had to do the adult thing. Yes, adult choices. Yes. Because I was like, uh, could I really? Because I was like, I want to get something at the Jack Sept So obviously, yes. Being wise with money. Yes. It's so hard for you to adults. See the ki people who watch me who are still in high school. You're so lucky. <laughs> yeah, so lucky. Um, or just in school in general. I don't yeah. know. Um, but yeah. So we're just gonna have a wee trip around Edinburgh before we go see. Jacksepticeye. Yes, we have about four hours to go. Yeah, I think we're gonna go to a Harry Potter shop. Um, we might film in the Harry Potter shop because I don't think they'd be that bust. I don't think so. I just didn't want to film in the anime shop because I just in case they're more of a quieter shop, so didn't want to just in case. Yes. But yes, so I'll see you guys soon. Edinburgh, you know, that's where you go. Yes, on. Um, I don't even know what that street's called. Uh, if you're. Oh no, uh, it's next to Fresh Market Cross? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's where the stairs are. We will say, we, before we got in the shop, we heard oh, screaming. Mm -hmm. And we thought it might be the accepted guy because it sounded like Bad Girl screaming. Um, but it looked like there was a bunch of stairs. Yeah. So I think I'm guessing fame. I'm not, I'm not into skating, so I have no idea if they were famous or not. Yeah. But yes. But yes, anyways. Great Harry Potter shop. Right. We will go to the next place or whatever we're gonna do. We'll figure it out. Yes. Okay. But see you guys soon. So here we are at the playhouse. Where Jack's gonna be performing. Yeah. We were handed these to put over the flashlight on our phones. So yes, yeah, when Jack walks out on stage for to do this. Yeah, put it over our flashlight so that it comes out green. Yes, so I think that's yeah, I think that's very much what the idea is. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, I'm so looking forward to this. <laughs> so yes, we just um, had our food there at Frankie Benny's and then came over because off the place we were at was just literally across the road. Yes. So we're ready to go see. Obviously can't show you what's going on inside, obviously, because I don't want to get drunk. Yes. So, but I will, next time you see me, I will tell you what I thought of the show. Okay, see you soon. Hey, it's me. Um, yeah, so, just got back home from Edinburgh, and yeah, 
the show, honestly, the Jacksepticeye tour show was amazing. It was funny, a lot of references, and uh, like I loved it so much. It was like, yes, fast early Christmas present ever. Basically, it was an early um, Christmas present from uh, my girlfriend because she got the tickets. But yeah, I uh, loved it so much. It was so, so good. Um, yeah. Like, if you guys obviously have maybe seen it, you probably know what I'm talking about, but my god, it was so good. And like, literally, um, where we were sitting, we were literally like 10 rows away from Jack. Like, we were on the bottom floor, um, and literally we were 10 rows away, so we were quite close to the stage, which was pretty awesome. Like, it was so, so good. So, yeah, it was, yeah, sorry, uh, I'm also tired very very tired because uh, it's been a long 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 weekend we had Rikon and then we had uh, Jacksepticeye so yeah so obviously I'm back home now uh, my girlfriend's going back to her flat and yeah and I'm probably going to like sleep until like there's no tomorrow anyways guys I hope you enjoyed this video remember to like and subscribe for more random content and you can check us out